morning. Please be seated. My name is Dr. Bill Law, and I'm president of St. Petersburg College. I'd like to welcome you to the 131st commencement exercises. Today, we congratulate the students and their families who have persevered to the graduation milestone. You inspire us with your determination. Today, we celebrate your accomplishments. St. Pete College's summer class represents a diverse group of associate and baccalaureate level candidates, as well as those receiving certificates and applied technology diplomas. Among our 1,030 graduates are 16 who are receiving more than one credential. 32 of you are between the ages of 50 and 60. 15 of us, okay, yeah, pretty good. Fifteen of us are older than 60. Our youngest graduate today is 17. And our oldest graduate is 72. For every two male graduates, there are three female graduates. And best of all, four of you are receiving your diplomas on your birthday. <laughs> Congratulations to you all. Including those awarded today, the number of degrees and certificates awarded by St. Petersburg College since its beginning in 1927 is 156,574. Now, please stand as Pastor Matt Whitten um, from Pinellas Community Church of St. Petersburg offers the invocation. Following the invocation, please join in the singing of our national anthem and the reciting of our Pledge of Allegiance. The national anthem will be led by one of our outstanding SPC alumna, Ms. Joy Gann. Pastor Witt. Good morning, class of 2016. How are we doing? You alive? I'm reminded of the words of the Apostle Paul in Romans chapter 12, verse 15. He says, rejoice with those who rejoice. And today we not only celebrate with you, we celebrate you. What an, a momentous day one that you'll look back on for all of history, all of your life, and remember this special time, this special moment. Can we pray this morning? Lord, we thank you so much, God, that your faithfulness through years of hard work, through years of study, Lord, through years of countless stressing over tests and finals and everything that comes along with the academics and the rigor of scholarship, Lord, today we thank you for being faithful to us for all these years. Lord. Not only that, but we look forward to your faithfulness in the years to come. As we are now equipped with the education that you're calling us to, to fulfill our destiny and fulfill our purpose here in this life. Lord, thank you for our time at SBC, and God, I, I thank you for this time this morning. Lord, that it would be one of celebration, that we would truly rejoice with those who rejoice today. In Jesus' name, everyone said, Amen. amen.
I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you. Please be seated. The graduation ceremony is a time to honor you, the graduates, as well as a time to honor those who have helped make this college the great institution that it is today. We are governed by a five-person board of trustees. Those trustees are Mr. Dale Oliver of St. Petersburg, Ms. Laura Lee Westing of Palm Harbor, Mr. Bill Foster of St. Petersburg, Mr. Devron Gibbons of St. Petersburg, and Mr. Nathan Stonecipher, also of St. Petersburg. With us today is also the former chairman of our board of trustees and the board's current attorney, Mr. Joseph H. Lang. Mr. Lang, would you please stand? <laughs> the trustees provide leadership and guidance to the college administration and have served these graduates over the past several years. In addition to all their other involvements, which you'll see noted in the program, they give many hours of volunteer service to the college. The day-to-day -day experiences of our students on our campus reflect the core and leadership of an experienced leader at each site. Together, our campus provosts have crafted a program of student support that is fundamental to our students' success. I would like to ask our campus provost to stand and be recognized. Our academic deans work hard to make sure students get a quality education while they're here at St. Petersburg College. We're privileged to have them with us today. Would the academic deans please stand? Thank you all. Thank you. I'm extremely grateful to our vice presidents and our executive leadership team that provide ideas, concern, and guidance to me on a daily basis. One of your fellow students, Ms. Kelsey Brunvard, is a member of our leadership team. Would those leadership team members sitting on the platform today please stand? It's a special honor to recognize our faculty senate leaders. Please stand when I call your name. Ms. Mary Hanlon, Vice President of Faculty Senate, Dr. Shannon Ulrich, Clearwater Campus. Without a doubt, those here at St. Pete College who play the most critical role in the lives of our students are members of the St. Petersburg College faculty. They are committed to teach, to nurture, and to guide our students on a daily basis. They also contribute personally to the national standing and reputation this college enjoys. Thank you, faculty, for investing in our students, for lifting them up, and for taking time to help assure our students' success. Would faculty members please stand while we express our thanks. <laughs> now to our students. If you've been a participant in the Honors Program at St. Petersburg College, please stand and be recognized. If you are a member of the Student Government Association, please stand and be recognized. I'd like to recognize students who are members of our honorary organization, the Phi Theta Kappa. Please stand if you're a member of the Phi Theta Kappa from any of our campuses. Let me recognize those with academic honors. 
Students graduating with an associate's degree who achieve a mini minimum cumulative grade point average of 3.3 receive the distinction of graduation with honor. Would this group please stand? Thank you. All degree-seeking students who earn a 3.5 to 3.69 grade point average receive the honor of graduating cum laude. Would this group please stand? In addition, all degree-seeking students who earn a 3.7 to 3.89 GPA receive the honor of graduating magna cum laude. Please stand. Well done. And finally, all degree-seeking students who earn a 3.9 GPA or above receive the honor of graduating summa cum laude. Would this distinguished group please stand? Congratulations. <clears throat> Among our graduates are two students who've been selected by faculty and administration to address you today. Our first speaker is Ms. Darcy Worms. Darcy is a student on our Tarpon Springs campus where today she will receive an AA degree. Ms. Worms will be attending the University of Florida to obtain a bachelor's degree in language and linguistics. Ms. Worms. Congratulations, everyone. We are the class of 2016. It is such an honor to be addressing my fellow graduates along with their families and friends. When I started at SPC nearly four years ago, I had my ex expectations set high. I wanted to graduate in two years, so I took a full load of classes. Unfortunately, life doesn't always go as planned. Instead, I struggle with anxiety and depression nearly every day of those first two semesters, and I end up failing badly. I let myself down tremendously and felt lost because of it. I couldn't even try again because I was placed on academic probation. Part of me was definitely ready to call it quits, but I realized it was okay to ask for help, to admit I had made some mistakes. SPC helped me get better and fix things, both academically and personally. They assisted me with getting off academic probation and start counseling. So, though some days were still tough, I needed to take the bus to class almost every day, and there were times where my depression reared its ugly head, but there was always a member of faculty or staff willing to help. Now I'm here, graduating today, and transferring to University of Florida next year. <laughs> Thank you. I owe a huge set of gratitude to St. Petersburg College, and that's putting it lightly. My point is that life is unpredictable and sometimes it's unfair. Just try to, roll to, try to learn to roll with the punches the best that you can. Don't let a stumble keep you down. We all fail sometimes, it's just part of being human. When it happens, don't be afraid to ask for help, even if it means you have to acknowledge your failure. In the end, all you can really do is grow from your mistakes. Sometimes these struggles may seem insurmountable, but that just means they'll make you that much stronger once overcome. Every one of us has faced our own obstacles on the path here, but we've made it. Again, congratulations to everybody graduating today. Thank you so much to everyone who helped us along the way, the amazing faculty of SBC, and the family and friends who have supported us. Thank you. Thank you very much, Ms. Worms. Congratulations on all you have achieved. Please accept this uh, diploma and uh, this uh, certificate as a token of our thanks for your work. Our second speaker is Mr. Sain Haidara. Today he will receive a Bachelor of Science in Public Policy and Administration. Mr. Haidara has served as a student tutor 
in the Learning Support Center at Clearwater Campus. He is a former president of the International Club and a member of the Phi Theta Kappa, Mr. Haidara. Thank you, Dr. Law, Board of Trustees, Scholarship Foundation, staff, faculty, family, friends, and graduates. I am an international student from Timbuktu, a city in the West African country of Mali. <laughs> and, <laughs> and I am very happy and honored to stand before you all today. Indeed, today is not a day like any other. It is a day that we will remember for a very long time. And it is a day that we will certainly reminisce about with joy. Growing up in Timbuktu, in a less privileged community, did not only present financial and academic challenges for me, but most importantly, it made me realize the value of a college education. I believe that education is the only route that helps to break the cycle of poverty and to bring hope into a community. <laughs> At an early age, I asked myself, what is my purpose here on earth? I decided that, happily, my life has two purposes. One is to be educated because I believe one can make a difference through education. And the second is to improve the lives of all people in my Timbuktu community and in all of Mali. <laughs> Helping to make a difference has always been an important mission for me. At St. Petersburg College, I was able to gain leadership and community service skills which I believe will allow me to help the people of Mali address the issues such as malnutrition, illiteracy, and instability. SPC has made me feel at home, and I was welcomed as a valuable member of the college community. <laughs> SPC helped me to make the dream and purpose I had at nine years old in Timbuktu come true. So my message to all of you today is this. Life will not always be easy. We live in a complex and uncertain world. Sometimes we come across difficulties, moments of doubt, and we will feel fatigue and be tempted by a certain resignation. In times like this, I want you to think about all the challenges that we have overcome in college, and you will find strength, I'm sure, to overcome any obstacle that might come your way. I encourage you, graduates of today, to use the skills and knowledge you learned at SPC to help your communities, but through civic engagement. By doing so, you will not only make a difference in the world, but you will also feel a sense of great accomplishments. There are many people who helped me on this journey, and I thank them all. I would like to thank the Center for International Programs, Ms. Ramona, uh, mainly Ms. Ramona Kirch and Ms. Angela Cole for the tireless support. I thank my sponsors, Tony and Patricia Leisner. I thank my public policy program instructor, Professor Jeff Crunchnabel, and his assistant, Elizabeth Vanskoy, who offered me guidance and support. I also want to thank my public policy classmates who worked with me diligently on all our group projects. I especially want to thank my mother for making the long journey from Timbuktu to be here today and watch me graduate. <laughs> Mama, 
Mama Hochi Jari Berjaru, Ninda Goy, Ninda Gari can cut so on deck. In Africa, we have many saints. We believe that if we stand tall, it is because we stand on the backs of those who come before us. And we believe that tomorrow belongs to the people who prepare for it. More importantly, we believe that a single bracelet does not jangle. In closing, this morning, you will not only go home with a college degree, you will leave this graduation ceremony, perhaps thinking that we go from here to Timbuktu. You now know that Timbuktu is a real place. <laughs> a place, a place where many things have happened. It is, uh, it is also a real community. It is my community. May you go up into your communities to help others and to realize what you can do. Thank you. Saying congratulations on all you've achieved. Please uh, accept this recognition for being here today and your work. Thank you. At this time, our Senior Vice President for Instruction and Academic Programs, Dr. Ann Cooper, will present each group of graduates by their degree, beginning with our baccalaureate class. Our class administrators will announce the graduates when they come up on the platform. Dr. Cooper, please present the candidates for Bachelor of Science, Bachelor of Applied Science, and Baccalaureate Certificates. Will the candidates for the degrees of Bachelor of Science, Bachelor of Applied Science, and Baccalaureate Certificates please stand? President Law, the candidates standing before you have presented their credentials for the awarding of the degrees of Bachelor of Science, Bachelor of Applied Science, and Baccalaureate Certificates. I hereby recommend them to you for the conferring of those degrees. By the power vested in me by the sovereign state of Florida and the Board of Trustees of St. Petersburg College, I do hereby confer upon you the degree Bachelor of Science Bachelor of Applied Science, and Baccalaureate Certificates with all the rights and privileges thereunto appertaining. Please change your tassel from right to left. Please be seated. Dr. Cooper, please present the Associate in Arts candidates. Will the candidates for the degree of Associate in Arts please stand? <laughs> President Law, the candidates standing before you have presented their credentials for the awarding of the degree of Associate in Arts. I hereby recommend them to you for the conferring of that degree. By the power vested in me by the sovereign state of Florida, and the Board of Trustees of St. Petersburg College, I do hereby confer upon you the degree Associate in Arts with all the rights and privileges thereunto appertaining. Please change your tassels from right to left. Please be seated. Dr. Cooper. Please present the Associate in Science, Applied Technology Diploma, and Certificate candidates. Will the candidates for the Associate in Science degree, Applied Technology Diplomas, and Certificates please stand? <laughs> President Law, the candidates standing before you have presented their credentials for the awarding of the Associate in Science, Applied Technology Diplomas and Certificates. I hereby recommend them to you for the conferring of the degree, diplomas, and certificates. 
By the power vested in me by the sovereign state of Florida and the Board of Trustees of St. Petersburg College, I do hereby confer upon you an associate in science degree or award you an applied technology diploma or certificate with all rights and privileges thereunto appertaining. Please change your tassels from right to left. Congratulations, please be seated. Graduates, the marshals will now guide you by road to receive your diplomas, beginning with our baccalaureate graduates. When you have received your diploma, please return to your seat and remain seated until all of the graduates have crossed the stage. Charles Tego. <laughs> Rosie Ty Lee. Jesus Benitez. Lori Uzbek. Shelton Van Locke. Rafael Mercado. Craig Money. Catherine Hargraves. Priyanka Moonhandin. Sarah Soloway. Graduates from the College of Business. Jerome Nuttall. Alexander Sheeran. Richard Kelly. Andrew Kaiser. Graduates from the College of Computer and Information Technology, James Panatagios. Ora Rocha. Eric Saylor. Nikita Fluker. Myron Wu. Graduates from the College of Education, Kenneth Watson. Lisa Heather. Aaron Kelly. Alicia Edge. Janie Ramos. Michael Williams. Graduates from the College of Health Sciences, Kelly Dixon. <laughs> Kelly Davila. Brittany Randall. Graduates of the College of Nursing. Gracia Quadra. June Sivitz. Graduates from the School of Policy, Ethics, and Legal Studies. Eric Froon. Robert Harty Jr. Sean Mikola. Krista Bartholomew. Jason Terry. Dardan DePaulo. Graduate of the Public Policy and Administration, Sane Hadara. Donald Paradez. Jennifer Diaz. <laughs> Joshua Willett. Molly Jeffers. Crystal Hauk. <laughs> Lakeisha Powell. Graduates from the College of Public Safety Administration. Jesse Gutierrez. Jennifer Molin. Nicholas Rabetti. Kevin Kennett. Graduates from the School of Veterinary Technology. Brianna Violet. 
graduates with an Associate of Arts degree. Sydney Mundorf. <laughs> Madeline Helene Stubbs. <laughs> Christopher Moore. Christopher Lowe. Marlena Ashley. Julie Yateman. Eva Cano Fernandez. Nicole Lynn Norick. Latora Spivey. Asna Squire. Linda Johnson. Sol Torres. Justin Patterson. Jose Vidalia. Tao B. Vo. Kayla Heller. David Elias. Tiana Rodriguez. Stephen Simmons. Jessica Jones. Lene Jackson. Elizabeth Saul. Bree Jackson. Nicole Kao. Lydia Fletcher. Jasmine da Daniel. Cherie Golden. Israel Nieves. Trinice Green. Tara Tutela. Eileen Morales. Michael Ross. Jason Peters. Nicholas Gatmona. Stephen Cudson. Marissa Nieves. Ashley York. Jacqueline Kezig. Yolanda Simmons. Wesley Bayward. <laughs> Natalie Taboka. Douglas Blair. Aaron Will. Christian Whitmire. Christian Cervantes. Lakin Hamby. Alexis Cluvizio. Matthew Fernandez. Ashley Harmon. Catherine Kleinspire. Kimberly Petit. Medina Swanson. Babette Lent. Alma Huggins. Hey. Janice Porter. Janice Porter. Janice Porter. You're welcome. Desiree Woods. Social Escalante. Amy Thibodeau. Thank Kayla Huell. Sean Lyles. Crystal Garcia. Christopher Baker Rooney. Amanda Henderson. Ethel Kennedy. Lakeisha Worthen. Candace Williams. Shoshana Mickens. Samantha Camporis. Ricardo Zuluaga. Alvaro, Alvaro Zuluaga. Joshua Marks. Thank you. Laquita Thompson. Lakendra Cummings. Denicia Shepard. Malisha Pahari. 
<laughs> Malin Quello. Rye John. Omidi Ambibola. Theodore Papadopoulos. Victor Merriam. Anissa Fullwood. Mary Morrow. Nazemia Alababidi. Ashley DeFiglio. Brandon Deza. Norman Bodie. Allison Marquez. Justin Bryant. Brian Shannon. Jennifer Farmbury. Melissa Johnson. Darcy Warms. Stephen Atkins. Samantha Spalo. Ariel Frank. Tyler McMillan. Help me with Benavides. Louise Benavides. Shayna Sissel. Colleen McNellis. Cameron White. Camille Custodio. Judy Bunn. Kristen Hutchinson. Nicole Capone. Haley Faria. Tiffany Presley. Christina Burns. Trenton McFarlane. Dominique McManus. Ariel Reno. Spencer Talby. Cody Gast. Tristan Weghorn. Kendra Weldon. Matthew Behrman. Chevelle Peterson. Ali Antar. Crystal Burke. Eric Charsley. Nicholas Cordano. Richard Smith. Jacqueline Anderson. Bryce Cicero. Eric McGee. Joseph Schiavone. Ulrika Nichols. Tara Fox. Jerry Lee Brown. Samantha Davis. Samantha Barish, Ethan Olivero, Austin Matansky, Alexia Dagnol, Emily Yakumis, Seth Norsel, Casey Alla, Artem Stepanin. Carrie Fenstermaker. Yeah. Jessica Hamrick. Carissa Hubbard. George Coleman. Michelle Minnis. Rhonda Bailey. Yeah. Melissa Wilkes. Catherine Ciadella, Shamika Macon, 
Ashley Collier. <laughs> Melissa Young. <laughs> Ted Martin. <laughs> Benjamin Bergman. Sean Hyden. <laughs> Kaylin Fisher. Angela Segovia. Dwayne Johnson Jr. Rose Seika. Charmaine Grant Johnson. Pamela Robinson. Jeremy Ehlers. Jason Evarts. Megan Johnson. Betty Mack. Sherry McMillan. Bethany Gossen. Diana Atikovic. Sarah Foster. Barney Shaveria. Moni Sear. Amber Wilkinson. Kevin Lassiter. Sarah Mignon. Kayla Smith. Jasmine Rogers. Amy Lorraine. Sherelle Paris. Shavika Satcher. Samir Az Azmi. Jessica Alksan. Fatty Baskaran. Monica Seed. Dovil Kavarati. John Lassere. Gloria Boykins. Samantha Harris. Associate in Science, Amber Yonker. Nomi Gonzalez. Anthony Chaquan. Vicky Grantham. Lourdes Mahoney. Yalina Belitska. Emil Yakuba. Joseph Rauschenthaler. Michelle Gibson. Sarah Cook. Brian Jeffs. Justin Lowry. Joseph Adams. Christopher Percy. Kalia Austin. Jesse Pineda. Kathleen Obasa. Victoria Lang. Taylor Smith. <laughs> Melissa Ritchie. Amanda Doraman. Daniel Nichols. Celeste Hotchmuller. Brianna Weatherwalks. Alyssa Vasquez. Cynthia Golden. Barry Callaghan. Dana Taylor. Tawanda Bryant. Robert Giola. Regina Murray. Nicole Davids. Adam Gates. Woo! Jennifer White. Karen Karen Garrett. Stephanie Crispins. 
Stephanie Meyer. Mitchell Whitehall. Monica Evans. Anyava Kia Blackshear. Tiffany Foster. Wade Smith. Yasmin Clark. Shantavia Leverett. Dajinka Matellas. Ashley Berryhill. <laughs> Cynthia Wise. Benjamin Hernandez. Esteban Negrit. Mimi Felmi. Richard Hazelwood. Indira Lugo. Fiorda Muhammad. Tiana Baker Harris. Rushton Freer. Joshua Morris. Pete Caccino. Bernadette McCarthy. Certificates and Applied Technical Diplomas. Rajesh Patel. Mariana Hernandez. Ladies and gentlemen, the graduating class of 2016. Please be seated. To those of you in the audience who are the family and friends of the graduates, I know there have been times when you felt that none of your hard work and support of these graduates was appreciated or even noticed. But here you are, and here they are, and these graduates did appreciate you, and they did notice you, the college appreciates you. Graduates, please join me in saying thank you to your family and friends. Without them, this would not have been. And as you, the guests of our graduates, are here today, I'd like to ask those of you who are alums of St. Petersburg College, or formerly St. Petersburg Junior College, to stand and be recognized, alumni.
Let me add one more thought for the guests who are here to honor the graduates. I hope you'll consider the role St. Petersburg College can have in your lives. At this college, opportunity is always beckoning to people of all ages and backgrounds. I think it's been made clear today that St. Petersburg College can keep your dreams within reach. Graduates, you've received and acquired a lot of knowledge from one of the finest faculties. Now the challenge is to apply that knowledge with wisdom, and by doing so, you will more than likely experience success in your life. Lastly, I'd like to express appreciation for the music today, which has been provided by Ms. Lynette Gill and our vocalist, Ms. Joy Gann. Would you also thank the folks who have made this uh, commencement uh, ceremony possible? You see a lot of people who have put in uh, a lot of hours to make this work just right. Thank you all. <laughs> Graduates, thank you for choosing this college. We were privileged to serve you. With most sincere appreciation, we pay tribute to your accomplishments. And now, Vice President Miles, please come forward to conclude today's ceremony. Pastor Whitten will now pronounce our benediction, which will be followed by the singing of our alma mater. The words to the alma mater are found inside the back cover of your program. Following the alma mater, please remain in your seats until all of our graduates have exited the auditorium. If you or your family would like a photograph with Dr. Law, he will be available outside the church under a blue awning immediately following the conclusion of the ceremony. Pastor Whitten. First Peter 4 says, each of you should use whatever gift you have received to serve others as faithful stewards of God's grace in its various forms. Class of 2016, you've got gifts, you've got talents, you've got skills. Who will we use them for, us or the world? Let's pray. God, I thank you for this time. Lord, I know that you've got a, a group of world changers here in this room with us this morning. Lord, we're looking forward to reports and stories of graduates and students of SPC going forth and changing the world, changing lives. Lord, I pray that you give us the strength, the commitment, and the endurance to see that task through. In your name, amen.